So Call of Duty 2020 will be called Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War. Now, I love it. The rumors perfectly line hard up. Point. Capture and defend the hard point. When it moves, you follow. Hard point identified. Secure the area. Oh, from behind, from behind. So the brand new Call of Duty for 2020, supposedly rumor, take it with a grain of salt, will be called Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War. Now, again, if rumors are said to be true, this is going to be a reboot of the Black Ops series for modern gen consoles, PS4, Xbox, probably PS5 and um, Series X if they're out at the time, which they should be out by the end of this year, but I don't know if they're going to be out before or after um, the, the Call of Duty 2020 will come out. It's leaving a lot of people speculating that maybe that might be or maybe not the case because of how Warzone is doing and how great it's doing. Compared to anything else Call of Duty has seen for a battle royale in uh, the series before. I think just like Blackout before it. You know, Warzone is good for this year. It lasted. But I do think it will get replaced for whatever Blackout might bring out into. Oh my god, I'm, I'm on fire. But I think whatever Blackout might... Black... Black Ops. I'm, I'm getting them confused. Whatever Black Ops might bring in as far as a BR competitive... I think it's going to be its own unique thing. I, I don't think that we are like tied to Warzone or tied to Blackout as we just seen Blackout just disappear. Basically, it's still live and people still do play it daily. But I think people would agree that, you know, Black Point. Time in the grand scheme of things has gone away and for Warzone for a good reason. You know, Warzone is great. Enemy personal radar in the air. What do I think about the the name of Call of Duty Black Ops Vietnam being, you know, Cold War being the name? I think it's, you know, it's okay. I mean, I think the Black Ops name, just like the Call of Duty Modern Warfare name, could stand on its own and be its own thing. It doesn't really need a subtitle. Those names are so embedded with the Call of Duty franchise at this point that people know what they're getting when they jump into a Modern Warfare. 
people know what they're getting when they jump into a Black Ops game. They know the feeling of the guns. They know the feeling of the maps. You know what I'm saying? So I do think using those names as pillar points makes sense. Adding something like Cold War to Black Ops will just kind of... I don't want to say dilute it. It more so separates it from the original OG Black Ops. And I think that's what they mean to do with the name. I love Call of Duty. I love Modern Warfare. I love Blackout. Um, Blackout. Black Ops. I actually didn't love Blackout too much. The um, the Battle Royale that was in last year's Call of Duty. While I didn't, to me, it wasn't calling me like how Warzone called me. It wasn't, you know, intriguing. At the time, I guess Fortnite was the top dog when it came to my battle royal experience and I just wanted to play Fortnite all the time too. It wasn't like it was just like the mood I was in. It was like an all the time thing for me where I just wanted to play Fortnite over playing any other battle royale. And maybe that was just the time. Fortnite was just on its hard, you know, doing everything great at the time. So it makes sense. Just as a little, while we're here talking about um, Call of Duty, I have to bring up that I love this map, Parhat, and super happy with how it looks and that they brought it back. To me, it's one of those maps that is just like, it feels perfect as far as, you know, it doesn't feel too big, doesn't feel too small. It's one of those that like, it's, again, perfect. It's, it's one of those maps that are just like in your brain if you ever played Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3, if I'm not mistaken. Um, I got I seen him and I didn't kill him. What is that about? Location secured. Get to the next one. Oh my god, that's it. trying to shoot the rocket right there yeah so I, I'm in love with this map and I love the way it looks now I feel like it's a little bit bigger on this side I could just be remembering it wrong I don't remember this area in particular that I'm in right now this hard point Get it back to the target. 
Oh, damn it. They got me. She shot me. Oh, got me, got me, got me. We've taken the lead. Oh, we have? Wow, this whole time doing this commentary, I 100% thought I was going to lose. I wasn't playing like I was trying to, like, go hard and win, but now that it's a close game, that's well, I'm getting my ice kicked now. Now that I'm saying something about it. And it is a close game. Let's, let's try to actually win this. Let's see. Oh, wow. Good place. Good placement. Oh, all right. Not paying attention. That's me. Wow. How? How do you survive that? Ah! I was reloading when I didn't need to. Why was I doing that? Yeah, they got this. That's going to be the video, though, for my thoughts on, again, this Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War rumor. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Are you hyped about another Call of Duty, especially after such a big one, Modern Warfare and Warzone, all dropping within a year? Like, it feels like less than a year at this point. Is it too much Call of Duty? And especially with what um Call of Duty the remaster, the Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 remaster. Also dropping this year. Granted, that was just a campaign, but again, sizable Call of Duty content, tons of it dropping within you know one year. Let me know if it's too much, too much Call of Duty, or you're you're up for it like me. I'm down. We're we getting black ops this year. Let's fucking go so i'm hoping they somehow could integrate warzone into it rather than start a whole new thing but if they do start a whole new thing i'm down for that as well let me know again in the comment section below your thoughts of it like always guys i'm gonna see you guys on the next video thank you thank you thank you for making it to the end of this video if you're not a subscriber and you made it this far hit that subscribe button you know you want to join the family ring the bell so you can be notified on the next time i drop one of my videos as well as hit the like button on this video so it could be recommended so more people can check it out so we can have more people join in the family if you want to keep up with me on other social media platforms such as twitter instagram or tiktok or whatever i'm daddy gamer fred on all all of those again daddy gamer fred you'll be able to find all those links in the description of this video and the pin tweet comment on my twitter also on all of my videos i do answer all comments so again if you just want to chat it up about the video or anything just hit me up in the comment section below i take time out of my day and literally answer to all the comments that you guys leave me and i love it and again let's have that conversation down there here are a couple of suggested videos that you guys should check out that may be of your interest i am a variety channel i do tons of stuff tons of pokemon but tons of other stuff as well so dive into these videos peace i love you guys i'm gonna see you guys on the next one